Warning. Unwelcome activity in the station premise. Stay in your cabins. Warning. Crisis defense activated. Attention. Unpermitted activity in the propulsion core. Gates closing. Hi, these are reviews from Mob.org, and you're listening to Jay. Let's get started. What would happen if you tried to combine Dead Space with Mass Effect? Yes, you'd get a game named Dead Effect. Why? Because Mass Space just sounds stupid. Seriously, today we'll be talking about this strange experiment gone awry. In the game you play as a soldier, trying to get out of the next space station, where the next virus generated the next zombies. At first, I thought this had to be the most hackneyed plot I have ever seen. But after I thought about it, I was sure it was. I can't imagine how such ideas come into people's heads. Maybe they're not people. What if the plot about zombies is thought out by zombies in order to make people turn into zombies? Maybe they've already had their brains eaten and have no ability to come up with an original thought anymore. Just look, we even play like zombies. After choosing a woman or a man, we appear at the space station and get briefed on the situation. At the first glance of Dead Effect, you'll understand why it would be more appropriate to call the game Resident Alien Dead Trigger Effect Crisis Doom 3. Oh yeah! This game would pay off by its name alone. So, having regained consciousness in some unknown compartment, with only one meager weapon at your disposal, it is necessary to find the next weapon, and then the next, and the next, etc. We already mentioned that the purpose of this game is about killing zombies. No, there's something resembling a plot here, because on some levels there are slices of narration that aim to help deal with an epidemic of zombies at the end. So I guess you could say there is a plot, where everything is solved with a gun? Oh, and guns there are! Also, each of the guns can be improved by increasing its destructive power, firing accuracy, and some other categories. In the game there are 10 missions, which provide a minimum 4 hours worth of gameplay, sure to brighten up a boring afternoon. It appears I somehow trashed the game more than I praised it, and it definitely deserves better than that. So let me mention some words in defense of the game. Dead Effect is nevertheless a good action game with magnificent graphics, convenient gameplay, and captivating music that adds a good share to the atmosphere of the game. I can only hope that the next game won't be called Mass Space after all. In general, I recommend the game to all players that love violent, gory shoot-'em-ups, except for small children. After all, there's blood, guts, and a lot of violence. And I don't want your mothers to accuse me, this game, your computer, now even your mobile device, that the game disturbed you in such a way that you can no longer eat your tomato soup. That's it! If you liked it, download it, put like, follow our channel, and enter the group. There's still a lot of interesting things to find there. This was Jay, with a review from Mob.org. See you!